Well, as the great Jeff Taylor would say, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be watching. Welcome to the British Basketball League. Cheshire Phoenix taking on the Puma City Patriots, and the Patriots getting an early open there from Taylor Johnson. Well, Basel fans, we do want to apologize. We are facing some technical difficulties here at the moment. That block, we will keep you updated. No foul called. Patriots come over to steal. They have numbers in three on two here. Oakland goes in with a one-legged fadeaway. And again, the Patriots building that momentum early on, Graham. Yeah, Jacob Wiley, they have really strong play. Finished with his right hand from the left, but the defense couldn't do anything about it. Oh, <laughs> Nowhere to go here. Good defense. Joe Hart had the three-pointer. Miles Johnson to the basket. Johnson able to finish, and he'll go to the free throw line here for the three-point play. The assist coming from Joe Hart. From Taylor Johnson to Joe Hart. Great to see Joe getting a start here tonight. And now we're under 10 there on the shot clock. Splits of defense goes up and a heavy rejection. Now they got numbers. Faulkner's going to go up. Draws and knocks it down. Chalmers sets a screen, splits a defense. Oh, are you kidding me? This guy went in and around the defense. This gave a lot of me. Here's off the screen. That's a little kiss off the backboard. Handed finish for the putback. Three-point ball game. You know, for a pick and pop, three points way off the market. TJ Howard, another big offensive board. Gets rejected. Joshua with a chance to push this. They have numbers. Look out. Oh, baby. Oh, oh bit of head-to-end -head basketball. Man that runs the floor. Throws it down with a bit of authority. And now Paul James calls timeout. He gives you all-round stats. He did it last year with Hemel Storm, and he's doing it exactly the same here with Cheshire Phoenix. Scarlet White went for the pump fake. Hesitated. Finds Hart in transition. Mason Faulkner tries a three-pointer. Can't get it. There's a long way out, Joe Harp. They think they'll be looking for Joe to pull the trigger there, but he just got closed out enough by the defense. Goes in with the Eurostep all the way. Counted. He's going to the free throw line. Simple play with the Eurostep. Little bump, and again, slight little touch-up. Defensively, they've done one good thing, is they've kept the Phoenix off the up three-pointers. Wiley pump fakes. That's continuation, surely get in there. Yes, sir. Jacob Wiley rolling the dice. One. Wiley's got two players. Uh, Graham, I'm surprised. I don't think I'd be surprised as why that wouldn't be upgraded to on sports like because the players got Cheshire just got caught ball watching on that play. Still leading by three points. I puts up a hell very oh, This guy oh, just throws up anything from anywhere on the floor. Got size and he's got range. And that is just a fantastic three-pointer. No thought about not. Bad offense for the Patriots, but not able to convert the three. But look out quickly. Phoenix get the ball in transition. Throws a lob up, and again, too easy. Now it's an eight-point ball game to the Phoenix. Offensive rebounds, extra possessions. Great job, Plymouth. Well, Plymouth doing a good job of keeping the Phoenix off the offensive boards. Can they chip into the deficit further? Faulkner throws up. Oh my goodness! Wiley Airlines again. Faulkner throws it up. Hey, big fella. Go. 19 points per game for Maceo Jack coming into this one, but still scoreless here in the first half. Chagua's been very good so far. Oh, I think he might have hurt me on that one, Craig, <laughs> because four point deficit, two possession game with Chagua. Using those elbows again, but this time turning it over. Good defense. Can the Puma City Patriots get something here in transition? And they go for another three. This game becoming a roller coaster. Both teams build some momentum. Well, they took the gamble. Scarlet White makes the pay. Can this guy, when he gets going, when he gets cooking. And just keeping the momentum of Plymouth City Patriots in. Yeah, that's disappointing. Oh, what a dive. Finding Chagua. Big man goes up. Finds Maceo Jack. He gets a second field goal. But Johnson found a bit of time and space. But. Diving on the floor, another turnover. Well, we got numbers. Well, by Chag, well, look out below, and he throws it down with two hands. Now, shifting, shaky, what a pass. Oh, it's got to be a foul, surely. Johnson comes up, gets rejected. Well, what a block shot. Again, you talk about no transition points, a golden opportunity for Plymouth to get something. Faulkner in the corner. And that's why it's disappointing, Graham. You had an opportunity to get something in transition, and this is a team that struggles to get things on the fast break. We're trying to go all the way, trying to bully his way to the bucket, making it a 10 point ball game. Yeah, Ethan Chargwell, special player, great talent to be in the British Basketball League, so strong, but great touch as well. 
Faulkner makes a bit of contact, goes up, getting the M1. And much needed M1 here for the Plymouth City Patriots. Well, certainly one of them. This time it was Faulkner attacking, and he gets inside position. 6-0 on the shot clock. Got to get something going. Goes to the top fadeaway. Cap, what a shot. <laughs> Dying moments of the shot clock. Penetration down the middle. One pass goes up. Another rejection. Wiley just said, not in your house. And Wiley is just everywhere. Look at that ball. Yeah, again, just Johnson can't, just can't quite get it to go. Just can't get any rhythm, the Patriots. Van Cota in the corner, three is up. Three is good. Oh, this one. Oh, got to get it bound. Van Cota, quick three in the corner. And again, oh, big time oh. three-pointer. And all of a sudden, Plymouth. Also, they, actually, we just got notice here. It was not a three-point, it was a two-point shot. Well, here's a problem now. Fouls committed by Johnson. Cheshire. Well, did that basket count? Johnson got good size, two meters eight. He's got to be giving Plymouth City Patriots as much as he can. Come off a ball screen. Can't yeah, just way too easy. No help side defense. It's back to a seven point deficit. Yeah, great play again from Cam Christen. He's been superb this evening. Johnson much better, goes all the way. Well, Cam yeah, makes a bit of contact. Dusha penetrated, kicking this out. Dan Cotto had the three, didn't go for it. Kicks off to Johnson. Johnson goes up. Tough finish under the bucket. Phoenix getting the first possession of the fourth quarter. They have a seven point lead. Jack with the pump fake goes in. Into the end. Get this guy simply. I was looking for a post up. Kicks this one out. Johnson down the middle. So you look at the post here, true, and they got the ball to Atwood. Atwood's looking for a post up. Cut down the middle. But all he's doing in the end is just congesting the lane. You're bringing your defense. That isolation with Skylar White in the post. Good defense again. Well, he got numbers. He's got to make the most of this. Johnson's got to finish this one. Goes up. Counted. Gets the ab one. He's going to the free throw line. Run. Yeah, great surge by Plymouth City Patriots. Good pass ahead by Wiley. And strong finish from Johnson. Shargoff's trying to play Rido. He's not been scoring so much today, but that was a great energy towards the hoop. Well, Quincy Rideau is going to try to finish this. Goes up. Now it's been doubled. Again, lack of spacing even on that part. 16, and it's as you say, you, things could be so different if you make the bulk of your free throws. Basel fans, we thank you for joining us here at the Cheshire Oaks Arena in Ellesmere Port. At the end of this one, it is going to be a good night as the Cheshire Phoenix win 89 to 77 against the Plymouth City Patriots.